So we say shop shop to you here on Morning Life. Two films made by participants of the President's Award for Youth Empowerment in South Africa were screened at uh, the uh, just-ended Cannes Film Festival in France. The UK film charity Films Without Borders, or FWB, joined forces with the President's Award for Youth Empowerment and worked with youth from townships and prisons in the making of the two 10-minute films in July last year, called The Robertson Challenge and Finding Ubuntu, Township Heroes. Well, here to tell us about the films and the work of the President's Award is youth leader Makoto Maiko. Good to have you. Good to have Welcome you to the Thank program. How did the audience respond to the films in Definitely. Definitely. Um, the audience was, um, you know, the response was extremely humbling. Um, and the films made um, was as a result of a partnership that had taken place between the Presence Award as well as a UK um, film-based charity um, called Film Without Borders. Yeah. And this, of course, involved, um, you know, giving an opportunity to two participants or two groups of participants to, of course, come together and um, produce a documentary. Um, you know, at their own resources, and it's been truly inspirational. Now, both of these films obviously dealing with different social issues, mm -hmm. um, and that was the main thread between them. Very briefly, just tell me about both of these films. Definitely. Um, so the first film, um, called The Robertson Challenge, um, was about bringing inmates together to work on a project um, in which, you know, they would prepare a meal, um, so to speak. But, I mean, they had absolutely um, no exposure to the outside world. Um, so you get to see, you know, themes of social cohesion throughout both the films, as well as the one about finding Ubuntu, which brings about um, a sense of togetherness, so to speak. Yeah, which is so important. But this, this particular President's Award, mm -hmm. um, uh, 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 how, how do the movies impact on the, on the work that the organization does? Definitely. And um, they do impact the award a lot. Um, by the way, it is a registered non-profit organization. Yeah. Um, has been operating in South Africa since 1983. Um, so we are in our 31st year, so to speak, and I mean it's further promotion of the award um, and impacting the youth, um, challenging the youth to be the best they can be. Yeah, and you as a youth leader, what is your role in all of this? Definitely. Um, so I did serve as former chairperson of the Gauteng Youth Committee, um, which of course involves you know, coordinating, facilitating and supporting activities within um, the program. Um, and really impacting youth in every facet and every dimension possible. And, and, and as we know, this is Youth Month um, mm -hmm. and, and lots of things are being done. From your side, what, what, what is going to, to happen this particular month? Definitely. Um, if anything, Leanne, I hope to be a rebel for two minutes and say I don't want to celebrate Youth Month. Um, I don't intend on celebrating Youth Month and that's because in everything I do, I aim to become influential and, and make that a lifestyle, so to speak. Um, practice, um, you know, active citizenship as a lifestyle and not just wait around the clock, um, wait for the 16th of June um, and really think about it. Although it is a time where we sort of commemorate and, you know, go into remembrance of, you know, a time when the youth was silenced and how that led to bloodshed and outbursts of violence. Um, it's just as important that, you know, we understand how that bloodshed was intertwined with um, a yearning for better opportunities. I mean, what better an opportunity than the Presence Award? Yeah, I like the way you, I like the way you, 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 you speak about it that way. I just want to know, um, these, these films now, where mm -hmm. to from here? What, what Definitely. happens? Um, I will be facilitating the exclusive screening tomorrow at the um, annual general meeting of the Presence Award. Um, and we're hoping, of course, to, you know, propose further funding of the program so that we can, you know, sort of spread the impact um, of the award program so this is really a stepping stone in that regard that's incredible so if people want to find out more inf information do you have a website or? definitely yeah. we do have a website um, the presence of Excellent. or they're welcome to follow me on Twitter um, at Mahoto underscore Mahiko or the Presence Award, um, or even drop us an email at info um, at the presence award .co .za. Excellent. Okay, so let's just give out that website. It's presidentsaward.co.za. Yes. You can visit the website. I'm sure you'll find all of those details, email addresses, and uh, all other contacts on there. Yep. And you can uh, follow uh, Mahoto as well. So it's, uh, is it Mahoto Maiko? Yes, Mahoto okay. underscore Mahiko. Excellent. All right, that's how you can get hold of uh, uh, Mahoto. Thank you for talking to us, and Thank good you. luck with, with all this amazing work that's happening Thank you very much. Uh, for the youth. All right, so now as uh, we head towards nine minutes to the top of the hour, we've got some...